In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called graphing an exponential function and its asymptote with one of these formats, f of x equals b to the negative x, f of x equals negative b to the x, or f of x equals negative b to the negative x. And our example here has f of x equals 3 fifths to the negative x power, and we'll be graphing by plotting five points, and then drawing the asymptote. And I'll start by recognizing that for each of these forms where we have an exponential, our shape will be either increasing exponentially or decreasing exponentially. And plotting five points is certainly one way to tell which we will have and create the graph. Making our table here, I always like to start with x equals 0, because it's usually pretty straightforward to plug in x equals 0. For our function here, f of 0 is 3 fifths raised to the negative 0, or just 0 power. 3 fifths to the 0 is 1. So we have our first point, 0, 1. And then our question would be, moving to the right or the left, is it increasing or decreasing? I can try the value of 1, where f of 1 is going to be 3 fifths to the negative x, or negative 1 power. The negative power means we invert the fraction to be 5 thirds. So we have 1 and the value 5 thirds. 1 and 5 thirds definitely shows that we are moving up, going to the right. If I were to go one more place to the right and try 2, then f of 2 would be 3 fifths to the negative 2 power, which is 5 thirds to the positive 2 power, or 25 over 9 which is 2 and 7 ninths. Again, we are continuing to go up, moving to the right. I should try at least one value to the left. So here I'll try negative 1. f of negative 1 would be 3 fifths raised to the negative x, but x is negative 1, or just 3 fifths. 3 fifths is smaller than 1, so we can see that it's moving down to the left. We need one more point. I can tell that it's getting smaller and smaller here to the left. So I'm going to go ahead and draw our asymptote here at 0. And then one more point to the right. I'll try 3. f of 3 is 3 fifths to the negative 3 or 5 thirds to the third power, making that exponent positive, 125 over 27. This is approximately 5. We can see that our line is increasing rapidly. So this would be the shape of our exponential function, and I've drawn the asymptote here as well.